morning guys day two you know what I'm saying <laughs> day two I'm waking up going on my morning walk so every morning I wake up I'm gonna start going on a walk and I'm gonna start talking to you guys but this is also the time this is also the time I use where I'm going to start using to uh, set my mindset and set my goals for the rest of the day you know, plan out my day, get my mind right, talk to God. You know, you want to stay connected. You want to stay grateful every morning. Look around when you wake up every morning because you know what? Somebody didn't woke up this morning. Somebody didn't woke up this morning and they were just your age. They had your exact situation. You know, it's just it was it wasn't their time. Oh, oh my bad. It was their time and they had to go and. That's that. But if you woke up today, man, that's another opportunity to go hard in the paint. Another opportunity to be yourself, your authentic self, through your gifts, through who you are, through your purpose. It's part to wake up in the morning and breathe, get you a little coffee, do your thing, get moving, get inspired, watch a motivational video, it's productive. I like, me personally, I like to watch Eric Thomas. He's the number one motivational speaker in the world. So, I mean, it only makes sense, right? And um, what this does is just gives me clarity. It just gives me clarity and focus. It gives me clarity and focus. And if you think about it, that's, that's the thing that distracts us the most in the society. I mean, that's the thing we have the least... Um, as a human being that's always working and always in that uh, constant pressure of society to uh, pay bills and uh, be in stress and in worry and the news and all those things. It's important to uh, wake up every morning knowing that you home the power. You control your mind. You control your thoughts. And if you choose to today, doesn't have to be that miserable, same routine, constant, just, you know, headache and like stress. Take a little breather, meditate, get your mind right, get yourself in the right mindset and then go execute, you know? It's really that simple. It's really that simple. Just say what you're gonna do and then go and do it. No matter how dumb you think you look or or whatever the case may be. I don't expect these videos to be perfect. I don't expect me to be perfect. So with that acceptance, I, I'm i trying something new. With that acceptance, I've uh, woke up every morning with a new fire, you know? And that's what it's all about. Finding yourself and knowing yourself through God. And um, through that, miracles will happen, blessings will happen. But you have to trust, you have to believe. He says, um, God's always saying that he's never testing our he's never testing our pockets. He's not testing how much money you have. He's always testing your faith, how much belief you have and to what's possible. Good morning. Oh, look at these. Look at these huge munchkins. What's up, guys? Y'all don't want to walk anymore? No. Ah. Oh. Now they do. <laughs> Who's this guy? Oh, watch out. Camera. They're like, what's that? <laughs> We're famous now. Right? <laughs> yeah. Good neighbor. Got morning walk, man. Little morning walk. Good morning. Yeah, good morning. Good morning. Get you right. <sighs> Let's remember to always wake up and give thanks, Pa. Just give thanks. Be grateful for everything you have. You know what I'm saying?
So set your intentions for today. The sun is shining on me. And go get it done. Don't procrastinate. Don't procrastinate, man. You got everything you need. You've always had everything you need. It's a matter of belief. It's a matter of belief. That's all it is. Believing you belong in that space with those people. I got a long way to go, but I'm here for the ride. I'm here for the journey. Remember, life's a journey. Stay positive. Stay to you know, water your plants. Water those people that are, that are being positive around you. Surround yourself with like-minded people. Because, you know, that's the only way you're going to start getting out of the habit of being a negative person in the morning if you are or if you, you know, always in worry or in stuff like that. You know? That's just going to happen. I thank God every morning. Wake up. Go use these legs. Some people ain't got legs. And I know it sounds so cliche, right? Like, wake up and be grateful for everything you have and everything, but unfortunately with us humans, it's like we don't learn until some some tragic shit happens. Like we don't learn until we don't start valuing our legs when 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 we have them. We start valuing our legs when we're in the hospital and, and we we have one leg decapita like fucking decapitated. You know, and we're in a wheelchair and we can't walk anymore. That's when we start valuing our our health. That's when we start valuing our our um, fucking legs and shit. Nah.